Okay. Um, my presentation is about a French chef called, uh, or named Paul Bocuse. Um, he was born February 11, 1926. Um, he's currently 87 years old. He was born in France. His parents are George Bocuse and Irma Reller. He started cooking when he was eight years old. Um, in, or during the World War II, um, at 18, he was enlisted. He ended up in a U.S. hospital where a blood transfusion saved his life. In, or since 1944, he has had a U.S. flag flying outside of his restaurant. Um, Le Beige de Pont de Colonge is the restaurant that he owns, which is outside of Lyon, France. It has maintained its three stars in the Michelin Guide for 46 years. He, in uh, 2011, he was named Chef of the Century. He took over uh, Le Berge de Pont de Colonge from his father in 1958. Um, this soup right here is one of his famous dishes. Um, he presented it for the president of the time in 1975, and it is a turtle or a truffle soup, and it has um, it's crowned with a pastry shell. This is a video, just um, a presentation of what it looks like. This is also another one of his famous dishes. Right here you can see that these are all the ingredients that are in his um, famous uh, chicken dish. And I was wondering, what do you think that these things are on the chicken? Do you see them? They're like little brown things. They're like toads. They're like toads. <laughs> no. no, toads. No. Oh, toads. No. Does anyone else have a guess what they are? What? Slugs? No. Okay, well, when I first saw it, I thought that they were um, dried up prunes, but they're actually um, famous mushrooms. Um, they're actually called morel mushrooms. And this chicken dish is poached inside of a pig's bladder until extremely tender, and it is um, sauteed in a cream sauce, and then those mushrooms. This is his restaurant, which is actually the house that he grew up in as a young child. Um, and it's called Le Beige de Pont de Colonge. This is the inside of his restaurant up here, um, where a lot of the people sit to eat. And then this also is his famous pose that you see in all of his pictures. That's the kitchen inside of his restaurant. And this is also um, another dining area inside the restaurant. It's a very elaborate restaurant. Um, this is one of his famous uh, lobster salads. And as you can see um, on the plate, the design is very elaborate. It, um, he tries to mimic the display of the plate based on whatever he's presenting on it, the food. Um, this dish in particular caught my eye because I found it very interesting that the sauces on the plate mimic the scales of the fish. Um, this is also another one of his famous dishes. Um, it is a, it's called quail quo, nay, and it's a mixture of a creamed fish, chicken, or meat combined with breadcrumbs and a light egg binding. And then I just have to show you some of, or his, um, his website and the menu. Um, but I was talking about the prices, wow, that's loading. Um, for example, his... His truffle soup is $82, um, just the soup itself. The lobster salad is $75. Um, and the chicken that I showed you is, for two people, is $217. So you can see that um, he's a very renowned um, chef, and all of his dishes are very, very expensive.
is right here. This is his menu, it's all in English. So you can see um, that everything is very expensive. He has a lot of um, dishes that are for two to four people, which are very expensive also. Um, so as I talked about the truffle soup, you can see that's like the very first thing on the menu. And then he has all of his seafood and um, meat dishes as well. And his desserts range, um, all of his dishes are $29 each.